Hey there, how's it going? Check out my jacket. It's from Germany. It's nice, right? Welcome to another episode of the Fashion with Rahul show. In today's episode, we're going to be going over four different ways that you can wear the cardigan to look amazing. And we're going to start right now. The first way that you can wear the cardigan involves wearing the cardigan with a t-shirt underneath along with jeans and then shoes. Now, instead of the jeans, you can also wear khakis or trousers or chinos and that's also fine. But overall, this is the general idea and this is the, uh, you know, the basic outfit. And this uh, way of wearing the cardigan with the t-shirt is super popular and it's super common and it looks amazing. Okay? Furthermore, the thickness of the cardigan over here also matters. So if it's like super cold outside, then I would recommend going for a chunky knit cardigan, which is just another name for a cardigan that is thick or a heavy weighted cardigan. On the other hand, if it's sort of like a springy day outside, or if it's not like super cold outside, then you can go for a medium weighted or even a light weighted cardigan and it'll look amazing. When it comes to the t-shirt that you're going to be wearing underneath the cardigan, you can go for either a half sleeve t-shirt or a full sleeve t-shirt. Either of those will be perfectly fine for this. Additionally, I would highly suggest trying to find a t-shirt that has a circular neck or a crew neck because it just looks so much better with the fall that the cardigan has at the front. Now, if you want to keep things simple, you can just go for a plain white t-shirt and that's totally fine and it's very common also. And so you can just take that white t-shirt and then wear like a black cardigan on it and you are good to go. On the other hand, if you want to wear a t-shirt of any specific color, you can do that as well. But when you're doing that, you want to make sure that the color of that t-shirt goes well with the color of the cardigan, right? Because you're wearing the cardigan over the t-shirt. So here's what you can do. So if you're wearing a t-shirt of a lighter color, then make sure that the color of the cardigan that you're wearing over it is of a darker color. Similarly, if you're wearing a t-shirt of a darker color, then make sure that the color of the cardigan that you're wearing over it is of a lighter color, okay? So essentially this difference in light versus dark is what is going to create a contrast between your cardigan and t-shirt. And if you apply that logic, then no matter what color of t-shirt or cardigan you're wearing, it's gonna look awesome, okay? Finally, if you wanted, you can also wear a striped t-shirt over here. And if you're doing that, then make sure that the cardigan that you're wearing with your striped t-shirt, make sure that that cardigan is completely 100% plain. Now with this outfit, when it comes to the jeans, you can go for either black jeans or dark blue jeans. Any of these will look good. And if you wanted, you can also wear trousers or khakis or chinos, they will look good here as well. When it comes to the shoes, it sort of depends on what the weather is outside. If it's like super cold outside, then I would recommend going for boot shoes, such as Timberland boots, because they help keep your feet warm. And if it's not like super cold outside, then I would suggest going for sneakers, they'll look awesome over here. So the second way that you can wear the cardigan is with a shirt underneath along with jeans and then shoes, as you can see on the screen over here. Now. You can completely button up the shirt all the way till the collar as you can see the model has done over here or if you want you can partially button the shirt either of those ways will still look good when it comes to the color of the shirt the same principle applies when we were deciding which color of t-shirt to go for when wearing it with the cardigan for outfit number one and if you miss that timestamp included click the timestamp but stay with me here also so essentially what you want is if you're wearing a lighter colored cardigan then you want to wear a shirt of a darker color if you're wearing a, a darker colored cardigan you want to wear a shirt of a lighter color because the difference in the brightness or the darkness creates a contrast and that is what makes the combination look amazing now with this outfit you can either wear jeans black jeans or dark blue jeans it look awesome you can also wear chinos or trousers and that look amazing as well this outfit is perfect for semi formal events and casual events now if you wanted you can wear a tie over here as well and that would make this outfit perfect for you know if you're going to the office or you know for any uh, business event and when it comes to the shoes you can go for oxford shoes or any type of office shoes okay so we've already covered two ways that you can wear the cardigan to look amazing. We've covered so much content already. Now, let's look at the third way that you can wear the cardigan to look amazing. And this involves wearing the cardigan with a chambray shirt along with jeans and then shoes. Now, if you don't know what a chambray shirt is, it is sort of like this blue shirt that you're seeing on the screen over here. And it gives you a masculine look <laughs> and it's an absolute essential to a man's wardrobe now if you notice that if it's very similar to a denim shirt you are correct it is in fact the only difference between a chambray shirt and a denim shirt is how they are woven right so a chambray shirt is typically woven by taking a colored yarn which is in most cases blue along with white yarn so the 
The difference between a chambray shirt and a denim shirt is, in the case of a chambray shirt, the two yarns are woven evenly, whereas for the denim shirt, they aren't. So that's the difference. And furthermore, a denim shirt is sort of slightly heavier than a chambray shirt because of, you know, that weaving. And so at the end of the day, for this outfit, if you're going for a chambray shirt, you can replace it with a denim shirt also, and that'll look good as well. Now, when you're wearing this shirt, you can either partially button it or completely button it. Either of those is completely fine and will look awesome. When it comes to the shoes, you can go for lace-up boots, Timberland boots, any type of boot shoes, and it'll look awesome over here because the thing is, boot shoes give you a masculine look, and so does the chambray shirt. And so they'll essentially come together and look great for your outfit. The fourth and the final outfit involves wearing the cardigan with a turtleneck. When doing this, make sure that the weight of the cardigan and the turtleneck is the same, or the weight of the cardigan is heavier than the weight of the turtleneck, okay? So that's it guys, in this video we went over four different ways that you can wear the cardigan and the different brands to go for when purchasing, you know, the outfits that we talked about in this video. I hope this video was super awesome and super helpful. If you like this video, please hit like, any comments are highly appreciated. And for more content like this, don't forget to subscribe. And uh, until then, stay stylish. Take care.